That's right, guys. We're back at it again. Hello, everybody. My name is Jurassic Jr., and today we are back with another episode of Reacting to True Story Scary Animations Part 5. <laughs> guys, I am actually not ready for this one. If you guys do not remember what happened last time, it, again, it was the biggest jump scare I have ever been through, and here it is. No! 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 <laughs> Yeah, it was probably the most terrifying thing I have ever been through while we're doing these videos. And another thing, guys, if, it, if this is out at the right time, I just want to say happy Halloween, everybody. And I hope you guys have a safe night. I will probably repeat that at the end of this video. But guys, we are here with part five. So we have one short horror animated and one horror short film. So without further ado, guys, let's jump into the video. All right, guys, so with the intro out of the way, before we jump into our first short horror film, if you guys like seeing these videos, subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell notifications to get notified as soon as I post a new video. And also drop likes, comment. It, it means a lot to me, really, it does. And also guys, speaking of commenting, comment down below what you guys are being for Halloween this year. I'm being Spider-Man, baby. <laughs> And also comment down below, what is your favorite type of candy to get on Halloween? Mine are the little bags of Skittles. Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> but guys, let's jump into our first short horror film by Wansi Entertainment called My Little Scary Teddy Bear. I don't know how a teddy bear can be scary, but let's see how this plays out. So without further ado, guys, let's jump into the video. My scary little teddy bear. Okay. Hi, my name is Shay. Well, at least Shay? that's what everyone calls me. <laughs> About 11 years she looks ago, so mad when her brother called her that. I moved from Mississippi to Nashville, Tennessee. Ooh, Nashville, Tennessee. My uncle and his wife and so they moved from Mississippi to Nashville, Tennessee. Place. About a month later, we found an apartment to stay Ooh, in. Ooh, nice house. I had a bunch of teddy bears that I <gasps> really liked between... Those are the scariest looking teddy bears I've seen in my life. Well, when we finished to move our new house, I decorated my room really nice. Okay, so and she's I set 12, my teddy bears 13. on my shelf okay. above my bed. A week later, I noticed Wait, one of my what? teddy bears would always go missing. And I oh, heck no. I thought he was taking That's a, a demonic teddy, teddy bear, bro. Yeah, but he really oh, heck he no. Why well, is he Spider-Man in the top, in the top right? Weird. So I <laughs> Why were eyeballs going to go see <laughs> they stayed in my closet for two days. Oh, yeah, stuff them in the Everything closet. Fine. Stuff them in the closet. That's what I thought until the third day be fine. has been started. The third day, I woke up on a Saturday and my closet door was What? Oh, what the heck? Was in the same place under my brother's whoa, bed. Whoa, whoa. I knew something was oh, wrong. Oh, that teddy bear is that, missing an eyeball. I immediately threw oh, my teddy yep, bears yep, away. Throw them out. That. Throw them out. Throw apartment. those teddy bears out, bruh. After that, we and I don't blame y'all moving, bruh. Don't forget the day of the move. Why is he moving? Whoa! In the fireplace from a human. We found bones in a, now, I'm in a fireplace? And I still remember that day, but I always... Okay, this is her being 23. Think, what if I set up a video camera Ooh. to see what the teddy bears to do with what they did? What was that, Chica? Wait, is that it? Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Guys, that was it, though. Oh, heck no, bro. That was the scariest little girl I've ever seen in my life. So you're telling me the teddy bears were possessed by that demon girl who had a large mouth? <laughs> and black eyes, though. Was that a black-eyed kid? Ugh. But yeah, guys, I don't know. It would have been nice if she set up a video camera to see what actually caused those teddy bears to become possessed. So, guys, that was really good. So, guys, if I have to rate this one, I would give it... Hmm, probably the lowest score yet. Probably a 6 out of 10, I'm being honest. Because sometimes you wouldn't think teddy bears would be a scary topic to touch on, but... 
Apparently this one helped. The only time I got scared is when it showed the teddy bears underneath the bed. That was the only time I got scared. But it actually, no, I'm being, I'm lying. The third time is when the girl showed up on the, on the screen. That was terrifying too. But guys, if that one was this scary, how scary is the next one going to be? Well, there's only one way to find out, and that's to jump into it. So let's head to our last video of the night. Okay, guys, so that last one was really scary, but our next one is called Close, Be Close Before Midnight, a short film by Crypt TV. Woo -hoo! I don't know what to make of this one. I am, I'm actually not ready for this one. The short films get me all the time. But guys, without further ado, let's jump into this video. Ooh, spooky sun or moon pumpkin employee handbook. Jacqueline's Halloween store. Rule number one, never stay past midnight. Yup. Whoa! Those monsters, oh heck no. Oh, this is a Halloween store? Oh, this is perfect! <laughs> uh. Ooh, that's a scary looking pumpkin. It's it's decorated pretty nice, I do say so myself. Oh, is that Jack Skellington? <laughs> that pumpkin looked like his face though. <gasps> Wait, is someone dead already? No, that person can't be dead already. Is he? Oh! Oh, wait, I know who you is! Is that Logan Paul? Oh, where did you come from, brother? What did you, what did you, what happened to you, bruh? Got tired of boxing and now you... Got tired of boxing people and then now you working at a Halloween store? That you're probably not getting paid much in? <laughs> Ugh. Oh, yup. Just trying to entertain the guests. And to be honest, there's no one in there, to be honest. <gasps> oh! Oh, it's almost midnight! Get him out of there, Logan! Oh, wait! He has a boot on his foot! Oh, no! Logan! Run, dude! Dude, don't... Oh, dress up like a... Oh! You done, Logan. It's over, man. I'm sorry, bruh. <gasps> You do not see the things moving behind you! Logan, you done, bruh! You done! Whoa! Whoa! Is that Annabelle? Or is that the grudge? Whoa! Run, Logan! Run! Run, dude! Oh! Oh, the, the, the decorations are coming alive! Run, Logan! Ryan, dude! Oh! Well, this is not the Lion King. Get Scar's intro out of the way of being prepared. Oh! Oh, what happened? Oh, Logan, you trying to hide, bro? Probably the best thing to do. But I don't think it's the best thing to do, honestly. Whoa! Oh, no! Logan! Oh, dude, Logan's gone! Oh, there's a Velociraptor on that roof. I just saw that. Oh. <gasps> Logan! Woo! <laughs> Close before midnight, guys! Dang it, dude! What was that? Oh, Crypt TV, man. Oh, heck no, bro. Oh. Guys, that was probably the best one of the night. I'll actually give that one a 9 out of 10. It got me really good. What keeps me from getting the what keeps me from giving it a 10 out of 10 is because it kind of felt like it was fast paced. Like it kind of felt like it was going fast, but again, that's why they call it a short film. And guys, with the last one done, we can end this video. And also, before I leave, happy Halloween. Woo! Guys, that last one was really good, actually. 
Um, the thing, the part that got me the most was when the little white doll, the little girl, the little girl doll with the white dress started coming alive and like starting like this. Oh, I hated that. I hated that, dude. I hated that so much. Like, just her irk, the movements that the doll was doing as she was standing up. I didn't like that. But I feel like that there was a callback. There was a Lion King-esque intro when Logan was running through those pumpkins when green smoke was rising out of the air. If you guys have seen The Lion King, you guys probably know what scene I'm talking about. I'm talking about the scene where Scar's song Be Prepared opens with him walking through the green smoke as the as the drums play. Um, but yeah, guys, I actually really liked that one. Crypt TV, they do really good at doing their short films really good. But guys, that is the end of part five. If you guys have enjoyed this video, do not forget to leave a big thumbs up, comment, subscribe to my channel. We are so close to 100 subscribers, guys. So get me there, and I have something planned for you guys. Do not worry one bit. But again, guys, I hope you guys have a fantastic Halloween. And I just want to say this real quick. Just be safe and have fun on Halloween. But the biggest thing is to be safe. That's probably the biggest thing I can say right now. I'll definitely be safe, and I hope all of you stay safe as well. So again, guys, if you guys have enjoyed this video, comment, like, subscribe. I am going to go get some rest, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out, Raptor Squad. So